Hello everyone, this is my 13th video on a sport diagnosis. Today I will show you an another condition. In this video, you can see the child is having the left upper limb abnormal movement. These are the clonic movement and child is conscious during these clonic conversion. So what will be the clinical diagnosis for this child? Clinical diagnosis on the basis of clonic movement of the left upper limb, child is having normal conscious level even verbalizing during the seizure time and seizure persists only for few seconds, no postictal phenomena. Clinical diagnosis will be focal aware seizure or the simple partial seizure. Previously, we used the terminology SPS, but now we are using the terminology focal aware seizure. And whenever child is having the focal seizure, we should go for the MRI brain to rule out the exole, intracranial space occupying lesions. So this is the MRI brain T1 image in which you can see this is a ring like lesion. It is containing the iso intense rim and surrounding this lesion there is a perilesional edema. It is very large edema surrounding this ring like lesion. And this is the T2 image of the MRI brain. And in this you can see these are the conglomerated ring enhancing lesion are present these are hyper intense and surrounding this this is edema is present so on the basis of these characteristic finding what will be the radiological diagnosis radiological diagnosis is tuberculoma these are the another image this is flare image and in this image you can see there is incomplete or no separation of the ring enhancing lesion in this flare image and this is post contrast T1 image in which you can see this is conglomerated ring enhancing lesion. These are the sagittal section and this is coronal section in which also ring lesion with the perilesional edema present. So in focal aware seizure, child may be having the aura. This is present in 70% cases of the focal aware seizure in the form of chest discomfort, headache or sometime epigastric pain. So before the conversion start, child will have the symptoms of the aura. And it is followed by the seizures. During this time, child will remain conscious and even verbalize. And seizure will persist only for 10 to 20 seconds and there will be no postrictal phenomena. So these are the characteristic of the focal aware or simple partial seizure. Focal aware seizures can be having the motor phenomena. So the tonic clonic movements of the one side of the body either of face, neck or extremities can be there or sometimes having the sensory phenomena. So child will have the somatosensory example paraesthesia or pain sensation of the contralateral part of the body in visual Child will see the scotoma or flashes of light, example. In auditory, child will hear the some ringing or some noise. In autonomic, child will have the abnormal sweating, flushing. In emotional, child will have the abnormal feeling, some funny feeling or something, some insect is crawling inside the body. So it is in brief about the focal aware seizures or simple partial seizures. Thank you so much.